his hockey IQ is like no other. Everybody back in Canada calls him Goal Perfetti. We've arrived at the billet home of Cole Perfetti, projected top 10 pick in the NHL draft, and uh, let's head on in and meet Cole. Hey Sam, hey, welcome Cole. to Saginaw. Thanks yeah. for coming. Thanks for Come having me. I'm fascinated by the whole billet thing. Like, you know, I've been around it for a long time, but you never really experienced it. You know, when I came in, um, I felt comfortable right away, and um, they, they opened their house up to me, and um, I, I, I feel welcome and part of a family here. Coming to the O, I never, my parents kind of did everything for me, and now um, <laughs> yeah. being on my own as a 16 year old, 17 year old, now 18, I kind of had to learn how to be sufficient by myself. Adjusting to life with a billet family isn't always an easy transition for junior hockey players. But for Saginaw Spirits' Cole Perfetti, it's a life he's very familiar with. The Perfettis were the proud billet family to three Oshawa generals throughout Cole's childhood. Andy Andrioff, Jeff Brown, and Cole Castles. Being able to, to billet guys that have made the NHL, gone into the next level, um, succeeded um, in the CHL, winning the Memorial Cup, um, you know, it was a, it was, there was a lot of learning, um, and they were great role models for me, and, and, it, and, and they're kind of leading the way for me. They're kind of showing, they, they've showed how, how to get there and, and what it takes to get there. He knows the importance of giving back. He knows the importance of, that he's a, a leader for those young kids, and kids are going to look up to him. And play, you know, see young players in Saginaw coming to the games wearing Perfetti jerseys now, and, and he was that kid at one point. Being a part of that Memorial Cup team in 2015, um, you know, being behind the scenes and seeing how how they did it and what they went through, shutting down McDavid and, and all these top teams and, and top players that year, um, it goes to show you how hard it is to win and what it takes to win and, and, and how how to do it. You know, I remember watching, going on the ice and, and watching my Billup Brother Castles um, skate around with the cup and, and hoist it, and it kind of you know made me think to myself that I want to do this one day and, and I want to be in his shoes. I think if you're a kid, and I know Cole was down on the ice when at the Memorial Cup when they won it, when you taste that and you feel that, you're coming to this league. Okay, and we're under pressure, rim release. We gotta make sure, so this rim release, we're talking about Fetz, you watch where he is, he's in the bumper. Cole gets it, he times it. Eventually, he'll end up in the net. Zook should end up in the slot. The early taste of life in the OHL ultimately helped Cole pick the Saginaw Spirit instead of an NCAA hockey program. It's been a perfect match ever since. Well, I think he's probably the biggest recruit arguably our organization has ever had and I think when a player of Cole Perfetti's stature comes into your program it makes recruiting a lot easier. Here we go honey, here we go, oh! Yeah, all showtime eh? All for the camera, all for the, all for the gram. To get a player like Cole to leave a college commitment, an Ontario player to move so far away from home, an elite player, an elite person like Cole has really helped elevate our program to what it is now. He's a special player, he, he's a special person, and I think that's why one of the reasons why so many people want to come down and, and you know play for the organization. Taking lessons from his billet brothers when he was younger, Cole Perfetti not only learned how to balance life as a player and a high schooler, but he also learned the importance of being a role model off the ice. You know, it, it kind of breaks my heart every time you go in and, and you see little kids um, suffering and, you know, it's not their fault and there's nothing they can do about it, but you know, they suffer and, and there's, there's really nothing they can do and it kind of just always wanted to start a charity and get involved in, in, in this and, and with little kids and, and being able to you know, try and make their day better and make them feel better. It's really embraced being in the community and being in the hospital and, and we created this program named Fetz Friends for him to come and give back to, to the fans that come here and, and spend their hard-earned dollars to watch him play. It's taken off so far with, with the Spirit Foundation and, and with Fett's friends, you know, the combination of the two, uh, being able to, 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 to raise money and, and, and bring, um, you know, a spirit section and, and a place for kids to have fun. Meet the future, powered by Ram Trucks. Innovative, capable, luxurious. Back-to-back -back winners of Motor Trend Truck of the Year.